ready for another one here. Liquid white's already on the canvas. This is his little hair. And in this one, he's got contact paper, so he's got this nice rounded window effect. I don't know what, I, I cannot find contact paper, or I don't, really don't know what he, he's using to create those effects. So I just went with thicker masking tape at the top and bottom and these cross things and hoping that'll look like a window. Um, I'd rather do like he's doing because in the end it's supposed to look like you're looking through a window and seeing this nice winter scene. But as far as the contact paper goes that he's using, I can't find it and I'm really not sure what he's using. So we're going to go with this and hope for the best. And uh, liquid white's already ready to go and here we go. Here, just making our normal little crisscross strokes, little X's, and just paint right over the top of the mask and tape and everything. Just paint right over it like it's not even there. Because if you were looking out the window, the little cross members in the window would be in front of whatever you've seen anyway. So just paint it on. Maybe a little bit in here, wherever, wherever. There, a little more of that color, and we'll put a little bit up in here, like so. There. Just make the little X's or a little bit of the liquid white that's on the canvas and automatically your color will just blend together.
big old birch tree. There. And this one. I've decided this one's in the front. So we'll do him last. Always do the thing that in your mind is the farthest away. And then work forward, forward, forward. There. These are fun. I like to make old birch trees. When I lived in Alaska, I used to do a lot of paintings for the tourists there. And they always wanted birch trees and northern lights. make a little patch of land or something there instead of the fence. If you're looking out the window, on the old windows supports here that there's a little snow that has just collected in here. This is a gorgeous painting to give as a Christmas present. So now he's putting just like a little snow on each where the window is. So I'm going to... straight up liquid white to do that. I'm gonna go right over that tree. Oi! We're gonna hang on gather on each little part of the window. A little bit gathered right there.
you'll see it, but it's there. It's like a slight, slightest bit of blue in it. So you might see like a little bit right here against that white, who knows? It's a subtle detail. If, if it shows up, great. If it doesn't, you're not gonna miss it, kind of thing. This one, again, I have a ton of liquid white on here because I'm gonna go right over all this paint. And a little touch of dark sienna. Little white, little dark sienna. Cut off a little roll of paint. Let's go right up in here. And let's just, let's highlight this so it stands out a little bit more. Oh yeah, that's much better. Sort of rest in there. We want it to pop out. That's what makes it interesting. If you try this painting, take the time and do a photograph and send us. I would love to see what you're doing. And, and every so often, we put them together and put them on a little board. We show them on TV so you can see what people all over the country are doing with this. Okay, we're about to get this little devil thing. All right, so he's about done. So I'm, he just peels the stuff off now. So let me shut that off. Now, moment of truth. The problem is that this tape is all tucked behind where it locks. So the side ones are on top. So let's, oh boy. Got one. This is nerve wracking, like you would not believe. See, like his is easy. He had everything positioned great to just peel it off, but I was afraid of it coming loose, so I tucked it back behind everything. So, all right. Yes, this is going to take me a moment. My hands have got paint on them, and the last thing I want to do is touch one of the white spots. How am I going to get that center one? I'm going to do this. I'm going to have to actually rip it right there. Suspense is terrible. I hope it'll last. else I could do to make this seem even more like a window you're looking through. You know, put 
very like just like a dark frame or something or whatever but this is so cool this effect is so cool I just wow I just love the way this came out very happy with this very happy I love playing with the masking tape and doing all these things let me get a shot of this I'm very happy with the way this came out So I did a little more work on it. I just adjusted the tree a little bit, a little darker, added a little more snow on the windowsills, and I purchased this frame. This It's got kind of a whitewashed look to hopefully complete the window look. So I'm going to pop that in and see what this looks like.